To get an understanding of the events that shape the liberty of today, we must look back hundreds of years to a time when Native Americans traveled the wilderness of western Missouri. Evidence of the area's importance as a hunting ground is found in recorded accounts and in the arrowheads and crude hand tools frequently discovered since the arrival of American settlers. But the legacy of the Native Americans in this area is their system of trails carved out over countless centuries. Those same trails paved the way for settlers, becoming a well-traveled route which crossed through the center of Liberty on what is now Franklin Street, and past the Clay County Archives and Historical Library, where numerous maps and records reveal most of what is known about Liberty's earliest history. There was an Indian trail that came right through Liberty. Uh, that may have been another reason why this location was picked. It was right on the trail that uh, led from uh, the eastern part of the state uh, to the western part of the state. The white settlers picked it up. They improved that trail and called it the Old State Road. It eventually became a wagon road. Um, and then, uh, as we know it, uh, as we call it here at the archives, it's Old Highway 10. Um, Old Highway 10, uh, as we know, comes into Liberty on H Highway, flows right through town, comes down Franklin Street, or came down Franklin Street, and eventually exited out what we call Liberty Drive now. 